Good morning, friends. This is Pastor Joe Parlikathayal. I welcome you in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ for this daily meditation. We have been meditating on the fruit of the love and the qualities of love, eight qualities of love. The final one is self-control. We started the meditation on self-control yesterday. Today, I invite you to focus on 2 Peter chapter 1, verse 5 to 7. Peter wrote, stating, Add to your faith seven virtues or qualities or strength. What are they? They are goodness, knowledge, goodness, knowledge, self-control, perseverance, godliness, brotherly kindness, and love. There again, in that list of things that Peter wants us to add to faith, one of them is knowledge. Uh, no, I'm sorry, uh, one of them is self-control. We are on self-control. Those of us who have faith in Jesus Christ, who believe that Jesus is our Lord and Savior, who believe that Jesus has chosen to come and live within us, it is important for us to develop self-control, both according to the fruit of the Spirit as well as the virtues that Peter is asking us to add, self-control comes in. How can we control ourselves? It is so hard. Look at all the people who were disciples of Jesus. They couldn't control themselves. They gave up on Jesus and ran away when he was arrested. Though in their mind they wanted to stay with Christ, but they couldn't control the fear that came upon them. Jesus asked the disciples to pray with him for one hour in the Garden of Gethsemane, but they could not. And Jesus himself explained, the mind is willing, but the body is weak. Yes, sometimes our mind wants to do certain things, but our body cannot tolerate it, cannot put up with it. Whatever may be the situation, sisters and brothers, God wants us to practice self-control. Now, how can we do it? In and through the power of Jesus Christ. If we keep on asking Jesus to help us to control ourselves according to his will, for his glory, I am sure it will happen. Because Jesus is with us all the time. He never gives up on us. So when we are tempted to lash out on others, when we are tempted to go negatively, when we are tempted to think negative thoughts, Jesus is there. Hey, look here, son, brother, sister, look here, I am here. I am here for you. I died on the cross for you. I will never give up on you. So be strong. What is the purpose of self-control? Be strong in the faith. Be strong in hope. Be strong in love. <coughs> Pardon me. Sisters and brothers, throughout this day, let us ask Jesus to help us to become aware of his presence within us to help us to come to him when we need help, especially with regard to self-control. Yes, unless we control ourselves, the devil will control us. The devil is so cunning. He would give all sorts of excuses to, to lose self-control. Sisters and brothers, let our self-control be Christ control always relying upon Christ, always calling upon Christ, always praising Christ 
for what he has done, what he continues to do. It is Jesus who set us apart as the light of the world, the salt of the earth. He will not ask us to do anything beyond our ability. He knows that we can definitely control our emotions, our thoughts, our mind, our body. Our body is under us, under our control. We don't need to be controlled by the body. Therefore, let us continue to commit ourselves to Jesus. Give our heart and mind to Jesus and tell him how much we want to love him. How much we want to receive his love and give it out to everyone in thought, in words and in deeds. Oh, sisters and brothers, let us make our self-control Christ control. Will you join me in this prayer? Let us pray. Eternal Father, we thank you for giving us this day. Thank you for blessing us to meditate on your instruction for us to control ourselves. Lord Jesus Christ, you know all our weaknesses. In spite of all our weaknesses and sinfulness, you have chosen to come and live within us. Enable us to focus our attention, imagination, heart on you all the time and seek your help with regard to self-control. Lord, we want our self-control be Christ control. We ask this blessing, Father, in the name of Jesus. Amen.